Hello and welcome to yet a quick tutorial. Today we're going to quickly learn how to be able to add um, transparent PNGs over our materials of our models. So in this case, we want to add our uh, charger uh, specifications of our model here. We have here a Samsung charger. <clears throat> so to begin with, what I'm going to do is um, I have the transparent PNG on the file. So we're going to quickly set this up in our shader editor. So before I begin, what I'll do is I will create, I will create our model ready, and we'll call this charger info. Now, what I would love to do is first and foremost copy the material attributes of this, and then I'll paste it over here. So now we're going to quickly set it up. The way we go about this is quickly go into our search and we'll go over to mix color. This is what is going to help us to be able to uh, mix our PNG over our material and we'll go add our image texture. <clears throat> so quickly, I would import our documents and the textures. So I have here my charger info that has been prepared. So any PNG file that you have, that's the transparency, it will work very well. So what we're going to do is we'll slap this onto our base color. Now, to make this work properly, what you want to do is you want to connect the color attributes to the B factor and we'll connect the alpha into the factor over here. So what we are going to be left with is we're going to see it over here. But before we do that, I want to make sure that um, our UVs are going to line up properly. So in my Z axis, I will go to UV unwrap project from view so that we will have it uh, set up. So now that we've done this, we will come over to assign and you see our label slapped on it. But if you take a close look at it, the background has a darker color into it. Now to make it match, we have to first and foremost um, see the actual uh, color code that we've used for our material over here. So to check on that, the base color that we have here, we have a hue, saturation, and value. So hue, zero, saturation, zero, value, 1.2, alpha, one. Now we'll come over here. We'll match the color over here to the color, the base color of the material that, for the model. Now if you take a close look, we have our hue, zero, saturation, zero, but this is actually 0 0.5. So as we increase it, you see that gradually it is matching to it. So one, you can still see the difference over there, but if we type it in completely 1.2, we have our model ready for render. And this is how you get your PNG to properly work with your materials. And this works both ways for both uh, cycles and EV. So we are currently in EV. And if I switch over to my cycles, So as you can see over here, now we have um, in cycles also, and it works both ways. So there's a very handy way for you to be able to slap your uh, PNGs over your materials for any model that you have within Blender. Thank you, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>